Good day. This is Letitia with Soul Spread Wisdom. And this is a follow up to my podcast that I recorded um, entitled um, Tracking the Moon. So I recorded on December 8th. Um, the moon was in the sign of Libra. And I recorded about the fact that my Christmas tree, which was supposed to be delivered, um, by UPS, I had ordered it through Amazon through a third party shipper and, um, my tree was delivered to an incorrect address and uh, it, it was only tonight that I received my Christmas tree. Well, I was tracking the moon and to see what it was, what was the moon doing and why it was that I did not receive my tree. And as I was tracking it, I was paying attention to when it would open up for me. And so I'm recording this for anyone who is interested in how the transits can be playing out in your chart, especially the moon, because the moon is very powerful and uh, she changes signs every two and a half days. And um, so when she was in the sign of Libra, she was making a square to my natal Mars and Mars has to do with movement and um, she was also making an opposition to transiting Mars in the sign of Aries so this was happening uh, the moon was in my third house which is about um, you know messages messages and packages being delivered and moving parts like this and communication so she was making a square to my natal Mars in an opposition to the transiting Mars. Then um, later on the next day, she would enter into a square with, um, with Pluto and Jupiter and then finally Saturn. Um, and then she would enter into uh, the sign of Scorpio in my fourth house and um, and so communication opened up when she moved into Scorpio from the seller and the seller let me know that I would be receiving a replacement, but I was not able to uh, get an exact date of when I would be receiving it. And so there were, there were things that were um, very unclear. Mercury uh, was in the sign of Sagittarius. He was being burned by the moon. And um, so I wasn't hearing anything. The moon transited through the sign of Sagittarius. She transited through uh, the sign of Capricorn. She met up with, you know, Pluto, Jupiter and um, Saturn had already moved into the sign of Aquarius, which is in my seventh house. So I received notification this morning at 7.07 p.m., I pulled the chart to see where the moon was at 7.07 a.m. this morning. I received notification at 7.07 a.m. this morning that my tree would be delivered today. And so I checked to see where the moon was and the moon was conjunct Saturn in my seventh house. So that served um, as notice that um, all of the all of the confusion was over. The moon joining up with Saturn in the sign of Aquarius um, was, you know, the, the planets were heralding that I would be receiving my tree, that there would be uh, manif manifestation, quick manifestation um, as the moon joined up with Saturn in this airy sign of Aquarius. So when I looked at it, I could see that all of the hindrances were over because Saturn um, is uh, in in this air sign placement, uh, which is movement. Things were unstuck at this point. And um, there was solid good news, you know, because uh, the moon uh, represented a peace of mind for me. She represented uh, things being settled and things being fixed and stabilized because when we started this journey, there were lots of squares and oppositions that were happening with the moon. But now for me, um, the degree that the, the moon was at three degrees and um, 
Saturn at zero degrees, you know, letting me know that there was a, a fresh new energy that was stable, that was fixed. It got here with no problem. I was able to put up the tree and things are settled. So I just wanted to share that if anybody listened to that um, issue that I had with uh, my package being received. So just tracking the moon, seeing how the planets are um, letting us know what is going on. Thank you for listening. Ashe, Ashe, Asheo, Yadhe Vavhe.